welcome to Unique Spirits. So, I'm doing a new moon in Taurus reading for the sun sign of Gemini. And so far, over on my Instagram and Facebook, I did a little mini two-minute video of the energy. And so far, this story is a karmic cycle is coming to an end. Um, it looks like one of deceit. And there's a decision that's going to have to be made. And it could be having to deal with travel or a vacation or um, moving. And it looks like there was a breakup of a union. Because there was a lot of fighting. And possibly juggling. So we're going to take this a step farther and see what more we can get. Spirit, can you give us more on the collective energy for the sun sign of Gemini? Now remember this new moon in Taurus energy is about growth, expansion, goal setting, spiritual growth. So figure out what it is that you want to see grow in the next six months. The energy lasts till about November. So set those goals. Ooh, we've got the Hierophant. The King of Swords. I feel like there was truth that came out about a relationship. A marriage, possibly. But this was all manifested. Someone manifested this. What more do we got, Spirit? Tell me what you need them to hear. We've got the Page of Coins and the Eight of Swords. I feel like someone's been in their own prison about a heartbreak, possibly about a reconciliation, about an offer. About being a choice in someone's situation. But I feel like... I feel like for you guys, the tower was possibly all of this. And I feel like the other tower is the movement that you're going to be getting. Ooh. We've got the lovers and Sarah. Look at this. This is the Three of Swords. I freaking love this card. It's so pretty. Yet yeah, heartbreaking at the same time. It's... It's getting hurt three times. This... That three is really standing now. This possibly could have happened three times. You might have a choice in love. Someone might... You might be a choice in someone's love. I feel like you left a situation going into a new one. Maybe not directly, but I feel like it's going to come fast. After, after the heartbreak, you have to get over the heartbreak in order for the movement to come for the lovers. You have to be done with the choices as well. Evolution. I feel like you're having a hard time with this new cycle. I feel like you're stuck in the sorrow. It's heavy in your reading. 
The movement is what will make you, the evolution happen. Solar plexus chakra. And surrender. Look at that. Surrender. Like exactly what I'm saying. It's time to surrender to the vine. Your solar plexus chakra. I would look into getting that, like meditating on that and getting it aligned. It's, that's an area you need to concentrate on right now. Especially if this is resonating for you. <clears throat> you got new opportunities coming. The universe is talking to you. And you need to watch your dream time. You're getting messages there. Spirit, can you give me moon signs that are related to this? Moon signs. Gemini and Virgo, Moon and Virgo, and we've got Full Moon and Gemini. None of your cards really wanted to come out. I feel like I was intuitively guided to pull your cards more so than them popping out. Justice. So Archangel Ragil. Ragil is one that you can call upon when um, you're feeling heartbroken, sorrow. An archangel, Shamil. I'm probably totally butchering these angel names, but I'll learn them as time goes on. Um, this one, I feel like you, when you're when you're scared about making those changes, that's when you call on this one. Spirit, can you give me a crystal card for Gemini? Ooh, I'm not taking all of those. I will take the one that came out on my hand, which is the Labradite. So I'm going to let you know what that one is all about. It's the mind's eye. The Labradite raises your consciousness to connect to mystical dimensions and the highest protective energies. It strengthens your faith in yourself and aids intuitive guidance. So yeah, that's what I have for you, Gemini. I hope your new moon is amazing. Do your manifestations. And I will talk to you in the new full moon. Please like, share, and subscribe. And I will see you later. Bye.